welcome back to my channel. Today we are headed on another adventure. You guys loved my first plant tour, kind of nursery shop with me video. So today I am heading about an hour away from here to a little town called Montrose. And I am going to check out a big box store. They have a Home Depot. And then I'm also going to check out a small local nursery that they have there as well. I have no idea what we're gonna find. Maybe I end up with a bunch of new plants. Maybe I don't find anything. Um, but I'm gonna grab a quick bite to eat, a little bit of caffeine for some energy, and through the power of editing magic, we will be at our first location. So I am here in Montrose. My first stop is at the Home Depot. Luckily enough, my locations, my two places that I wanted to shop are actually right across the street from each other. I just picked Home Depot first. It happened to be on the side of the street that I was on. So we are gonna head inside and see what we can find.
So probably not the best footage from in there, as you could probably tell, not a very large house plant section at this particular Home Depot. Um, and what they had really, some of it wasn't even worth filming, just not in great condition, not been taken care of as often is the case at these big box stores. Um, the one plant that really did catch my eye was that cow horn euphorbia. Really, really pretty, just not particularly, for me, um, as the channel name suggests, I'm definitely more of a tropical plant kind of girl, um, but still a lovely plant, something really interesting that I haven't seen a whole lot of. So let's head across the street, head over to a small local nursery called Camelot and see if they have any better selection there. So I'm here outside of Camelot Gardens. It is a small localish nursery. I've seen online that they've had a decent selection of houseplants in the past. So I'm hoping that I have a little bit of luck today. Maybe I just hit it on the wrong day, um, but I'm hoping for a little better luck than I had at Home Depot. So let's head inside and see what we can find.
gosh, you guys, I think I just found where I want to live for the rest of my life. It is so amazing in there. I didn't get a ton of footage. Um, I think some of the employees there were a little suspicious. What was I doing? Filming in there. Um, and not everything was priced or at least not very clearly priced. So if I didn't get the price on something that you spotted and you wanted to know the price on, I'm sorry. I was trying to be respectful of the owners of the establishment, all of that kind of stuff. Um, but there was a cute little gift shop. I got some footage of the outdoor area. It is so pretty and so cute. And just this wonderful, calm, interior in there just oh it's heaven um so i didn't buy anything but you may have seen in the footage i spotted a lot of great things that i've never seen anywhere else before um i've never seen the goldfish plant in person and that was pretty awesome that it was in bloom um those heart-shaped pilea um Peppermoides, those were really, really cute. I didn't catch a price on those, I don't think, um, but those were adorable. Um, and some of those amazing plants that weren't even for sale, just these big, huge, gorgeous plants. Um, so I really enjoyed going there. I'll definitely have to check back. Um, maybe around Christmas time would be fun. I bet all their gifts change over to Christmas stuff. So I know I've rambled on a lot. I'm going to drive home. If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already. Both of those things let me know that you like this kind of a video. If you want more plant tours, um, let me know in the comments below. I can go to some grocery stores locally, maybe go back to some of my local stores um, and just see what they have that's changed over. So thank you so much for watching you guys and I will see you next time. Bye.